Hi everybody, it's Kelvin Troy Johnson here. In this video, I'm going to explain how counselors and coaches can ramp up their private practice. You know, private practice can be really the dream for coaches and counselors out there and therapists, but if it's not done right, it can quickly turn into a nightmare. So I've got three keys to help you to grow your private practice, and here they are. Number one, change your mind. Many practitioners feel that being good is just good enough, but I'm telling you it is not. In order for things to really increase in your private practice, there's a mindset shift that has to happen, and that mindset shift is this. You are a marketer who happens to have a private practice. You have to begin to focus in on marketers and marketing and the whole process of selling and buying. You must begin to think like a marketer, study marketers, study Seth Godin, study the best best guys out there that you can find who are doing marketing or if you can't do it yourself find somebody who can help you but get some help in the marketing department number two be visible people buy from people that they know like and trust if people see your name associated with an article in the newspaper uh, or an article in one of those daily papers that are for free out there then they begin to notice you and they begin, you, you get on their radar and that makes you the industry lead. You can even create stories. You can even go and, and create a story for the, for the local television stations, for the news. And, and listen, the news is always looking for another story. You have plenty of stories. People that you've helped, things that you've done, craft a good story for them. Something that will build intrigue in the media to want to uh, to interview you. If they interview you, you are definitely the leader in the minds of the people. So it makes it so much easier to get the get people into your office and to build your private practice. And number three is preeminence. When I talk to clients and, and talk to people who are out there doing this work, I ask them, what makes people come to you? 